Okay, Coach Rhoda, the Liberty Center Tigers yes, sir. just knocked off the NWOA OAL champs, Revergreen, Green, right? That's right. That's so they beat you in your league tournament. Yes, sir. Yes. How bad? It wasn't close. It was not close. They were uh, 30 points, 40 points, something like that. Did yeah. you duel them this year? We did, yeah. Was, How'd that go? Uh, they beat us, beat us big, big. We had uh, a couple of really big redemption matches here. Um, for the OAC stuff, we throw in some sixth graders too. Those guys really performed well. So, uh, man, awesome. It was an awesome win. Liberty Center's always got guys. Always in the Division Three state tournament, there's always somebody placing. It's a great tradition. How do you guys get these kids to get together like you did and rally? You're going to wrestle for a state title next round against a bigger school. Maysville's bigger than you guys. Yes, sir. You know, they're D2 school, you're D3. How do you guys always have to, you have such a great tradition, why do you always able to put it together and have such good teams? Well, I mean, it starts at a young age. We've got such a good video program. We've got great coaches at every level. So those guys send all these kids up, and they they know what they're doing to begin with. But, uh, you know, this this particular group, is, it's gritty. You know, we got, we've got some kids that, uh, you know, they don't win a ton of matches. But, man, we're coming out and fighting for every point. We're fighting to stay off our backs, uh, and that, that's all the difference in these tournaments. So yeah, I'm looking forward to the next round. Hammer League, Hammer D3 League, you guys come out of Delta, yes, sir. Liberty Center, yes. Archbold. Wasion. Oh, Wasion. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's a really good league. It's a meat grinder. Really good league. Yeah. If you can win your league, normally you're in a pretty good position to stay, if to place in the state tournament in Ohio. Yeah. Um, does that, being in that great league, really help you guys uh, develop? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely does. You know, we, we feel like we're battle-tested going into every week. Um, you know, every week we, we get tough matches at every level, every duel, every tournament. You know, we see a lot of these guys over and over, and, man, it's, it's awesome to, to come out of a league like that and, uh, you know, get good competition regularly. Why is Northwest Ohio so good in Division Three wrestling? <laughs> That's a good question. I think I think we've got just uh, it, it says a lot about the the kids. We got a lot of gritty kids. You know, they're they're uh, a lot of farm boy mentality. You know, we just got some some tough kids that come from blue collar families and they're not afraid to work hard. Names. There's like the Hoffs, the Kearns. Those are the names I think of when I think Kearns is definitely the name I think of, yeah, right? Yeah, when I think absolutely. of Liberty Center. Yeah. Um, why are you guys so good with the generations of families and having so many different? generations come through those are just off the top of my head right yeah well what, what's interesting is uh you know you look down this lineup we don't have those names we've got basketball names you know Dayton Hops, we've got Rhymers. you know these kids are are coming from you know parents who were basketball players or, or coaches of basketball players uh, so you know it's just uh those names are uh, not not in here not this group right now we got a few of them but man just uh it just says a lot about, like I said, our, our video program and what we do. We can take kids that may not have that stereotypical uh, Liberty Center wrestling name and, and turn them into athletes. You're expanding out. I like that. That's good. You guys are getting more people involved. Yeah. That's what I want. I want more people in wrestling. All right, Coach. Heck yeah. You guys are about to come out here. I'll probably in about 15 minutes. You got anything else for me? That's it. Coach Rita, thank you for the time. Good luck to you guys moving forward. Thank you.